this is Gene Thorpe, Little Red Rooster TV, and today we're going to be talking about a rare and vintage guitar. This is a harp tone guitar, and uh, it's probably 1973. People tell me they call it the Ringo model. Uh, it's got a unique story. I bought this guitar in 1976 from a fellow that was down on his luck who uh, brought it into the guitar store that I was working at. We had it in the guitar, acoustic guitar department, where there were many Martins and Gibsons and Ibanez and uh, Ovations and that type of thing. And it sat there on consignment for quite a while. The guy was down on his luck. I purchased it, 1976, 42 years ago. I've had it all this time. And these were made in New Jersey uh, by Stan Kuntz. And he also built Standell guitars. And I would like to thank Eric Sutton and the boys over at the Facebook page. Um, they uh, have let me know a little bit about the guitar. And I'd like to thank uh, Larry Gosh for putting it in his uh, music store on display. It was there for about an 18-month period of time. And it was up high. It kind of dried it out, made the neck buckle a little bit. So I took it to Dave Lynch at Guitar Workshop. He reset the neck. It's as good as new. I love this guitar. It's got a great big C neck, jumbo type frets. It's got uh, this, I, I don't know what you call it, kind of a, uh, well, it's a, fr uh, a fret that's down at the nut. And Gretsch Guitars had them for a number of years. And, uh, you know, I kind of like the idea, really, when you, all the, everything sounds the same it, whenever you're uh, picking it because of that uh, fret. <clears throat> This guitar has a great pedigree. George Harrison thought they were good. He had 12-string and 6-string models. He and the band Badfinger used these at Bangladesh, the concert for Bangladesh. And um, I just want to talk a little bit about this particular one. This one has maple sides and back, spruce top, and a carved back. It's got a carved back. And uh, also, another uh, person that used these all through his career was David Bowie. He used the harp tone. It's got a very unique headstock. Um, I basically love this guitar. To have the neck reset cost me three times more than what I originally paid for the guitar 42 years ago. So you know I must really care about this guitar. Uh, and I would definitely recommend anyone who needs any uh, very high quality guitar work done, go see Dave Lynch. If you want to buy a guitar used or new, go see Larry Gosh at Encore Music or Skips downtown. Um, but this is Gene Thorpe, Little Red Rooster TV, and the Harp Tone Guitar, signing out.